How did Fairleigh Dickinson go from winning four games all of last season to beating number one seed Purdue in March Madness? Last year, FDU finished at the bottom of the NEC conference and fired their head coach. So they brought in Tobin Anderson. He was coaching St. Thomas Aquinas, a Division II school, and he brought three of his best players with him. Dimitri Roberts played four years at St. Thomas Aquinas, and this year playing Division I basketball, he averaged 17 points per game. And Grant Singleton, who played four years there as well, he averaged 14 points per game this season for FDU. They were the team's two leading scorers, and they led FDU to the two seed in the NEC. A couple weeks ago, they lost in the final of the conference tournament, but since Mary Mack is ineligible to play in March Madness, FDU got the invitation. As a 16 seed, they first had a playing game against Texas Southern, which they easily won by over 20 points. And then last night, they shocked the world and beat Purdue. Sean Moore, who had a huge game last night, last year he was playing D2 basketball at St. Thomas Aquinas too. Tobin Anderson really just proved that D2 basketball players can beat anyone. And to hear more March Madness stories, drop a follow.